Sega. I don't know what the fuck to say about these guys. It's so Jam and fucking Earl. Look at them. Look at this bitch. Fucking fat. The other guy probably stinks a lot. I get to be the fat guy. Just like in real life. <laughs> Not really. This is an epic storyline right here, actually. Wait, there's a story to this game? Yeah, these guys are highly funky aliens from Funkatron. You can tell how funky they are by how much uh, Earl taps his foot there. And smiles. And wears sunglasses. Man, I want that spaceship. I could go snowboarding with it. I guess, maybe. can't crank out funky tunes in space, I'm sorry guys. Well you can, it's just that those giant speakers wouldn't be the where you'd be hearing them from. They're probably hearing them from shitty speakers inside. Just like this, right? Clearly, the problem they have is that they're polluting space. Just think of the ozone they're not depleting. <laughs> I'm kind of scared of when we run into the dentists because they're going to probably blow my speakers. Or the boogeyman. Well, the boogeyman's not that loud. I mean, it's like every sound effect in this game is pretty balanced. Then you've got the sneakers here, which are like... And then you've got the, the fucking uh, dentist, and he's like twice as loud. Twice as loud, rather. How the hell did they fall this is down? This gravity works. <laughs> that must have been... Earth must have a lot more gravity than I thought. I like how they both just take this in stride, even though Earl is like a complete idiot and it's all his fault. That's exactly why he takes it in stride. He doesn't even know he did anything wrong. Yeah, but just think Tojam would KR care, you know, like smack him or something. Well, yeah, but then again, you have to think that Earl is Tojam's friend, and if you've got friends that retarded, you're probably used to it by now. I mean, remember that year when, when Earl basically blew up Funkatron and they had to go back in time to stop themselves? This never really happened, but, you know, you get the point. Well. I, to I totally call this present over here. This is my favorite present. I love this little silvery wrap thing. Oh, yeah. You get the McDonald's present. Hang on. We totally gotta go to level zero. We gotta do that like every run. Well, there's no reason not to, as long as you have the rocket skates for it. Or at least an inner tube. Well, it does take a while to get there, depending on what floor you finally find the rocket skates on. And how many uh, dentists you ran into before. That's always a, a worry. Alright, let's do this. I'll go down. There sure are a lot of devils around here. Well, here's the elevator. Checking the map, the game. Sweet, another one of these.
Yeah, we're gonna be checking that map a lot. I'm jealous that you got the first money. How do you people keep getting my number? Well, if you'd stop leaving your phone in the middle of fields... Well, this level sucked. Checking the rest of the map points. We get them separately. I can just get them too. Not, not if they're not there to get anymore. <laughs> no, seriously. Seriously, what? No, you don't. You get them for uncovering the map. If the map's already uncovered, you don't get them anymore. No, I don't think so. I I think it's separate for each character. Like if you go, go over a square you haven't personally uncovered before, you get the point. How would that even make sense? Get out of my cake, way. Well, that's how it works when you're together, anyways. It works when you're together because it's like presents. You don't get, uh, if you're not in the screen when somebody uses a present, you don't get it. So if you uncover the map when you're not in the same screen, you don't get it. Yeah, I could have sworn we tested this before, though. I do not recall such a test. I was able to walk over screens that were uncovered and still get points on it. You lie! You are a liar! It doesn't matter, we're probably gonna get like 50 promotion presents anyways. Nah, I doubt it. We'll probably get 50 rain clouds instead. Yay! Hints! Oh my god, it's like the most blatant hint ever. Pro tip! There is a ship piece here! Oh, here's the exit. You may have the exit, but I found a hot dog. I found a dancing chick. I found more money! money. Where does this go? I found the ship piece. Awesome snowboard. Dude! Oh yeah. Jamming apparently. Money. Damn you and your money! Fuck off, Satan! And now I have three of this present! I know what Carrot Man's getting asked first. 